What's up guys, it's your boy JRob447 back at it again with another video and this is going to be the newest series I'm going to do and it will be the Georgia State Panthers Dynasty mode and you guys saw in one of the videos that I made a preview for South Alabama I wanted to start with one of the worst teams in the game so I picked this team and you know I'm kind of mad because Georgia State's uniforms, like they, they only have two uniforms. They have they have zero alternates. So yeah, it's kind of sad to see that, cause you know I want I can't mix up my uniforms and stuff. You know, kind of look cool. Cause in Boise State you could do that all the time. TCU got some crazy uniforms. Same thing for West Virginia. But like with this team, I really can't get creative with the uniforms. So that's a downer. And what I'm trying to do is trying to get the Sun Belt to actually have a, you know, championship thing. So I'm trying to get there for at least 12 teams. So I'm going to be taking teams out of the independence, obviously. Like, maybe Idaho. Because, like, the Sun Belt is basically in the South. Made up the, of the worst Southern teams. Basically, like, the MAC is better than the Sun Belt. Like, the MAC, the MAC is way better than the Sun Belt. The Sun Belt is horrible. I'm sorry, the Sun Belt is just, is bad. And that's the league we're going to start in. I don't know. If we have a good season, we might still play in the uh, Sun Belt because competition is fierce, especially in this Sun Belt. Because there's a lot of teams in the Sun Belt that run that no huddle offense, which I dread. I, I cannot. I hate the no huddle offense in this game. It's so cheese. Like, Every time they do a pass play and your defense caught off guard, it's like first down. Like, it's, it's so cheese in this game. And, yeah, I think, like, too many teams in this game have the no-huddle offense. So, yeah, that's one thing, especially in the Sun Belt. It gets on my freaking nerves. I hate the no-huddle offense. But, yeah, basically, I will be doing this. I will be doing this uh series with my Georgia State team. And I'm going, I'm not doing a coach carousel. I'm not going to do a coach coaching carousel. Keep switching teams. I'm actually going to stay with this team for the longest I can. And I don't know if I'm going to get this game on next gen. I did, I was not intending on getting Madden. But ever since I saw that owner mode for next gen, I might get Madden. So for like next gen, I had to save my money up because I want to get Watch Dogs for next gen. I want to get Madden 25. I want to get FIFA 14 because FIFA 14 is only coming out on next gen. So, I want to get FIFA 14. I mean, honestly, I could keep this game for current gen. Because if it's not that different on next gen, then there's no reason for me to buy it. Uh, 2K, I'm definitely going to get it for both systems. So, yeah, because 2K is 2K. Like, nobody's messing with 2K. And, uh, oh yeah, for GTA 5, I if it comes out on next gen, I'm not sure. I'm getting that on release day, hopefully. I just got to save my money up. Because my parents don't pay for my video games like they used to when I was younger. So now, I got to make my own money up with this YouTube thing. You know, get paid. And I'm saving up for the PS4. And hopefully, I can come through and get the PS4 and get some of those games. But... Anyway, back to the gameplay that I'm showing you. This is not going to show any games right now. I'm just going to set up my recruiting board. I'm really looking for some tall wide receivers. I really like tall wide receivers because they can go up and get it and nobody else can get it. And I'm also going to change up my schedule, have a little bit of competition with Alabama, see if we can upset them the first, our first game of the season. But yeah, uh, what I was trying to do in recruiting, I was trying to get a lot of wide receivers. Uh, maybe a quarterback, you know, because a quarterback is essentially the core of the team. And as you're going to see in this series, like, quarterback troubles are were a part of this season. And, yeah, it's going to be it's gonna be crazy to watch. Like, once you guys watch this series, you guys are going to be entertained. And a lot of you guys wanted to request this game. You guys requested it. So, here it is. This is the NCAA Football 14 I'm sad to say that the NBA 2K13 Orlando Magic Association, like, it's not getting as much, you know, 
time as other like it's not getting as many views so I decided to discontinue that series but the my put the my career um summer league series I am gonna play one more game that's the next game is gonna be the last game and that will basically be the end of that series because it was supposed to be a mini series and that's what it is because I want to actually like make a 20 minute movie because I was gonna do it last year but my computer had problems so yeah I'm gonna do that and you know it's gonna be hard for it's gonna be really hard because I gotta do all this stuff and yeah I'm gonna be redshirting players right now redshirting freshmen see if they can improve because we're starting with a 60 overall all around like out of our whole team it's a 60 overall and our best player is a 74 no 80s on this team, like no 80s. If you have no 80s on your team, then that's how you know your team sucks. I will not be playing my team in this game or ultimate team, whatever you want to call it. Uh, I played one game and that's it. I played one game against a computer and one game against somebody else. That was basically it, you know. You know, I could have got this game used if I want to actually because basically this game has no online code you have to put in. So... If I was to get this game, I would not have to put in the online code and then essentially, wow, I can't believe I said essentially. That sounds so stupid. Anyway, I would have got this game for less because it's used. But I would probably never got the coupon that comes inside like the uh, Fanatics coupon. So it's, it's whatever. I mean, it's whatever. I'm going to get a shirt from that website because they, nice, they have nice shirts on the website. If you guys know what I'm talking about. But yeah. You guys heard that cruel mode was coming back in 2K. I uh, can't wait for it. They showed black top. I was like, what? Come on, son. Like, for me, crew wasn't that big of a deal. I mean, it was not that big of a deal. And especially that it's only going to be on current gen. It's really sad to hear about that. But to me, crew wasn't that big of a deal. But yeah, it's always exciting to have it back. And now I cannot wait until they start sharing information on my career. Like, if they start bringing out new stuff. Because, like, in next gen, you will be able to do a lot more stuff for games. Like, you're going to be able to expand the games out. Because you can only do so much on the current gen systems. So, on next gen, I don't know what they're going to bring to the table. A lot of you guys, like, you guys said that you want to have, you know, a house in 2K. You know, you guys want a free roam drive to practice. Like, I, I like that. Like, if you could go to practice every day, I, I like that idea. Go to press conferences. You know, it brings a whole nother element to the game because it's your career. It's not just you're on a team, play games, and improve. That's it. Like, it's a lot more you bring. It's a lot of dynamics you bring to the game. And if they did that, I would be very pleased. And I hope they do that because... That will be a big step in the 2K community because I was always a live fan and now I'm a 2K fan. But anyway, this has been another J-Rob video. Hopefully you enjoyed it and the next episode will be coming soon. Peace.